In VRC, an ADIS is prepared using the ADIS Maker module. Access this module through the Settings menu. The components of ADIS Maker are Location and Identifier dropdowns, Controller Information Template, Current Controller Information, the Current Meta, and the Voice ADIS Template, which also doubles as a text ADIS on the ADIS frequency itself. For VATSIM, controller information is defined as a few lines of operational information that a pilot receives when they first tune to an active ATC channel. ATIS is defined as the information sent to the pilot upon tuning to the active ATIS frequency. The text component of this message is sourced from the voice ATIS template, while the audio component is sourced from a recording made by the controller. Within VATPAC airspace, we must ensure that our ATIS complies with both the VATSIM Executive Committee ATIS policy, which limits the amount of information we can include, and the VATPAC ATIS policy, which specifies some standard abbreviations and formats that should be used. In most cases, we will be publishing a voice ATIS. To do this, enter a phrase such as ATIS available on 132.7 into the control information template. You can remove any automatically generated messages from this box. Click the refresh button to update your changes. This will send out this message to pilots joining your frequency, prompting them to tune to your ATIS frequency and listen to the ATIS. Next, set up your voice ATIS template. This box serves two purposes. To populate the record ATIS dialog so that you can simply read the information while recording, and to provide text version of your ATIS that is sent to the pilot client when the pilot tunes to the ATIS frequency. First, set up the script to record your voice ATIS. Enter the text and data as you like to better understand and read it when you are recording. At this time, the format and abbreviations do not need to comply with that pack policy. Click Record ATIS and record the ATIS message. Melbourne Information November. Runway 16 for arrivals and departures. Runway 27 for departures northeast. Wind 200 degrees at 14 knots. Visibility greater than 10 kilometres with showers in the vicinity. Cloud broken at 4000. Scattered at 6000. Temperature 14. Q&H 1020. Advise on initial contact. You have November. It's good practice to always leave a few seconds of silence on the end of your ATIS recording to serve as a separator between the end of one loop and the beginning of the next. To verify your ATIS, click play and listen to the ATIS back. When satisfied, click the save button. Back in the main ATIS maker dialog, Remember to remove any non-compliant terms from the voice ATIS template before you connect the ATIS. This will ensure that your text ATIS is formatted appropriately. Be sure to avoid using the runway selection function on the right. Simply enter runway information manually. You'll note that my, my ATIS is currently five lines long. This is not allowed on VATSIM as there is a four line limit. I'll simply remove the advise on initial contact message. Verify that the ATIS voice room and frequency are correct and then click connect. You can again monitor your ATIS by clicking the monitor ATIS button. Close ATIS Maker and VRC will indicate the current ATIS identifier and a small V will indicate that a voice ATIS is connected. To check the text ATIS that has been generated, you can right click the ATIS station in the controller list and select request ATIS. The text ATIS will be received as a private message. In summary, always try to record and maintain a voice ATIS. Specify in your controller information the frequency where pilots may copy the ATIS. Ensure you press refresh to update your live controller information and ensure your voice ATIS template complies with VATPAC ATIS policy in terms of its length and format prior to connecting the ATIS.